75 back, not too shabby. Hey guys, I'm back with another humongous grocery haul, and somehow this one was even more than the last one, and I was just there, and somehow I spent $307.28, so, and I had uh, $7 in coupons, and um, I don't know what I'm getting back from Walmart Savings Catcher yet, and I had $8.75 back from Ibotta, so not too bad. But I ended up spending more, and this was supposed to be a smaller trip. And I decided I need to quit telling myself this is going to be a small trip, because it just never is. When you make lunches all week and eat mostly at home, you're just going to accumulate a lot of food. So, I will go ahead and get started over here. So, start with a gallon of 2% milk. I'm going to try this. I've never tried the sugar-free Italian sweet cream, so I'm going to give that a try this time. Just ran out of my hazelnut, which I love. Um, some Sumatra Starbucks coffee. Two of these little guys. Uh, this one's pineapple, coconut lime, and or coconut lime water enhancer. And then the kids wanted to try grape, so I got that. And then some Peter Pan peanut butter, because this was on Ibotta, but of course I needed to get the bigger size. But luckily they had a deal where if you bought a gallon of milk and a thing of peanut butter, you got something for it. So I still ended up getting something, which was good. And then back here, um, I've been eyeing this Fuji Apple Clear, so I grabbed one of those. And a pineapple coconut, try that. And then they have cases of these, so I figured I would try one first. I want to say I've had this. Maybe it was in that uh, the other ice brand, um, but we'll see if these are good, and then we'll, we might get a case of those. And then, of course, some more of the orange cream, because these are beyond delicious. And Hannah picked these out, Cheez-Its. And then some peanut butter crackers, and some more of the everything cream cheese, Ritz crackers. Those are really yummy. And I'm going to give this uh, bag and season original chicken dinner thing a try for one of the weeknight dinners. We'll see how that goes. And then these were on I Bought a Two Famous Amos, but of course you had to buy two, which I did not. Oh well. What do you do? And then I found, Hannah saw this raspberry gum, so I just decided to give that a try. And then some fat-free uh, refried beans. Another thing of unsweetened applesauces. And the reason I get the unsweetened is because we sprinkle on cinnamon sugar on top of them. I learned that from a friend and the kids love it that way. So I always make sure to get the unsweetened kind since we're adding sugar to it. And then uh, on Ibotta they had the three Barilla, or Berea, however you say that, <laughs> products again. So I got another marinara plus I had a coupon for this. And then some of the angel hair pasta and some of the elbow macaroni pasta, and then I got some yogurt raisins, and two teas. I got the chamomile vanilla, which looked really yummy, and lemon ginger with probiotics. Another shout out to Sam Lovely and the season, chicken season thing. I saw those on her channel and thought I'd give these a try. They look good. And then some broccoli florets. These are on Ibotta, Gorton's fish sticks. The kids love these, and it's such a fun, easy dinner. Then I got some chicken to go with that bag and seasoning chicken dinner and then some ground beef because we were having spaghetti tonight. And let's see here, the kids saw these so I got each of them one and the reason I did I, is because one was a Squidward cup. So I got that and then Hannah wanted strawberry shortcake. And then I got uh, strawberries and cream, Premier Protein. Muscle milk was on Ibotta, but you had to buy two, which of course I didn't see, so I'm going to try the chocolate in that. Then Hannah pointed these out, which I love because I was going to buy the singles, but at Walmart they've got the packs. So you get five, and these are just the absolute best protein bars I've ever had in my life. They are so good. It doesn't taste like a protein bar at all. Um, so I got the chocolate. The mint chocolate is really super good, and then the caramel. They're all good, but the caramel, uh, salted caramel. And then the kids are obsessed with trolls right now. They watch it every single day. So they saw this and I was not gonna get macaroni and cheese, but it had trolls on it, so I got one compromised. 
and then I picked up some cuticle cream massage cream because my fingers right now it's so embarrassing I don't even want to show you they are so dry and I have an issue with messing with them picking at them it's sad and gross and embarrassing but it's the truth so I'm gonna try and fix that because I'm tired of it I'm tired of doing it okay and then some Colby Jack ultra thin cheese some 97% fat free beef franks. I've had these before and they are amazing. Really, really super good uh, hot dogs. And then for the rest of the family, because you only get, let's see, two, four, six, seven hot dogs. So for the rest of the family, I get these and that way these last longer for me because they are a little bit more expensive. Um, and then one more of these because it was on Ibotta. And my husband just really seems to like these. I love tiramisu. So I saw that and I figured I would give that a try. Then some more butter, and then my husband keeps talking about these, and I finally found them, the Buy Bubbles. So I got myself a pink grapefruit one, and I got him the black cherry. It's in that one of his lunches. Um, these were on Ibotta, and I had a coupon for them, so I figured I'd give those a try. And then some egg makers. And then let's see here, some pancake mix. I'm trying to be very organized because I've noticed every so often I'll miss something every time I do one of these hauls. So I'm trying to really be organized about how I do it. So pancake mix, I just got the Walmart brand. Danny had to have these, so I got him the cheap brand of Lucky Charms. And then these are brand new, and I had a coupon for them. So the Cinnamon Pebbles. Figured I'd give those a try. Then we got a box of Fruity Pebbles because it was you had to buy two. I think, yeah, from the coupon you had to buy two. And then these are on Ibotta for a dollar off. So Blueberry Pancake Crunch. Figured we'd give those a try. Then I got two pizzas, and these are on Ibotta. So those are always good to have on hand for us. And then let's see. We'll come back here and work our way up. So this was on, I believe, Ibotta. Purex with uh, Clorox. So give that a try. And then... Fabuloso, which I've never tried. I have know people that use it, but I've never actually personally tried it because I usually get the Target brand uh, stuff. But this was on, and then Palmolive was on, and it said Palmolive Ultra. So somehow I missed something because this was Palmolive Ultra Strength. So I got this thinking that would be part of the deal, and it wasn't. And this, I really prefer Dawn over it, but oh well, we'll give it a try and see how it works and I still didn't get my rebate but that's okay and then these cookies for being Walmart brand are amazing so I got another pack of that the family size kids wanted some pirate booty I picked them up that and then some Danimals and some pre-cooked turkey bacon which is really really awesome in the mornings I got three Tillamook yogurts because these are on Ibotta and then these Dannon whole milk yogurts we're on Ibotta, so those will be for the kids. And then they saw lemonade and wanted it, so I got the Just 15 Calories Lemonade. And then at this Walmart, it's the Neighborhood Market. And apparently they don't have a lot of stuff there that they have at the big one, I'm learning. So they didn't have the Walmart chips, so I just got the regular bag of chips. And then Hannah saw these Sherbert Cream Parfaits. She really wanted to try them, so I've got the pack of them. So I have no idea if these are any good. Let me know. I might try one tonight just to kind of see what it's like, but they look like they should be good. And we like Sherbert, so. Then some Smart Food Sea Salted Caramel. And some of the 45 calorie bread. Some Mission Soft Tacos, and there go the cookies, uh-oh. Some more of these wellness wraps. These are amazing. These are the most delicious, healthy wraps I have found yet. And I've tried several different kinds, and these blow my mind. Every time I taste it, I'm thinking it's going to be this grainy, wheat-tasting uh, wrap, and it is not. It's really, really super good. So, and then I had a coupon for these again, and Hannah wanted the chocolate, so I got those. And then some more snack wells, because when you're trying to watch your calories, you know, two of these is, one is 50, and two is 100, obviously. So, and they really do give you that chocolatey, rich chocolatey uh, kick. So then let's see here. I had a coupon for these. So I got these. The almonds are my favorite. They're the best. And down here on the floor 
again, we went to the neighborhood market and they don't have cookies there in the bakery. Like they don't have a bakery. So I picked these up for the kids as a special treat. And then this potato bread is for the husband. Big bag of apples again. Bacon. That was the cheapest one I could find that looked the best. And some light string cheese. Some more of this oven roasted chicken breast. And we're going to try, last time we got the Sweet Blue Bunny Sweet Freedom Mint Chocolate Chip. And it is like peppermint. It's like peppermint extract. It is way too strong. So I'm going to give this one more try with the bunny tracks. And hopefully this is a lot better. And then my husband seemed to really like these in the lemon. These splash water. So I'm going to get, I got the wild berries. So you can give those a try. Hopefully he likes those in his lunches. And then this was also part of that Nature Valley coupon. So I got the XLs and these are on Ibotta again. So double savings and these are amazing. Okay, on to the produce. Green onions. I got three pink grapefruit because these I love having something like this at night um, when I'm just wanting to munch on something, but I'm really not supposed to be. That's a real issue for me. So like a grapefruit, I've read that eating citrus at night uh, can be really good for you. It's very satisfying and it takes a long time to eat because I peel all the skin and all the inner skin and everything off. So it takes a while. It takes time. It gives me something to do with my hands. So that is a trick of mine. And then I got some broccoli, fresh broccoli um, for salads and snacking and stuff. And then two orange peppers. That's the kids' favorites. They pick out a different color every time. And then a bag of the butter lettuce salad. And then I got this because this is cheaper to get these. And we just go through peppers like crazy. So I got the trio. And then I got a couple of Roma tomatoes. And two more salads. I'm going to try it one more time for my husband. He really seemed to like the chef. So I got a chef. And then I love the Asian. So I got that for me. And three cucumber. So more of these cherry tomatoes. A couple more of the P3s. And I think I got everything over here on the table. Over here are the drinks. And I think this is what made it add up so much. Not only the protein shakes and the protein bars, but now all the drink stuff. So I'm going to try the Arizona Zero green tea. I found the strawberry. I'm so excited. So we're going to try the clear strawberries. And then I got the clear uh, black raspberry. And I get all this stuff so that my husband has all kinds of different drinks and variety and stuff in his lunches. And then I saw a trick, a girl I follow on Instagram for nighttime, like for a dessert type thing. She does a diet root beer. So I figured that is something I'm going to try to, again, to just stop those cravings at night. To give me something sweet. Um, this obviously has no calories, so we will see how that goes. And uh, some Capri Suns, some Splash Cooler Capri Suns, and then Watermelon Kool-Aid Gamers for lunches. Um, instead of the Milo's this time, I'm trying the Great Value to see, because you save like 30 cents or something. So anytime I can save money. So we'll see if that compare how that compares to the Milo's. And then the kids saw these, which I was not planning on getting them fruit snacks, but I gotta stop taking the kids with me. Um, so Trolls, fruit snacks, and then Hannah saw the Shopkins. So they're both very excited about that. So I believe that is everything. So again, the total ended up being $307. I had $7 in coupons uh, and then $875 back on Ibotta. And then we will see what Walmart Savings Catcher brings. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, let me know if you have any questions or any suggestions for me for these videos. Um, let me know if you have any videos, something different that you would like to see. Um, I would love to hear from you. And uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Hey guys, so I'm back. Um, I was putting everything away and realized I didn't show you the eggs. So I got two uh, 18 packs of eggs too.